Alright guys, welcome back to SideQuest Simulator. My favorite game. Alright, well... Fuck the Citadel. And... There is a ton of stuff here to don't know how to do. Like, ex server scientists and, uh... Sorry, Wasteland. Uh... Just trying to debate... What to do. Alright. Well... It has to be not a main one, so I don't want to do the quarians. I want to do all the side missions, so. Once again, I have absolutely no idea if, like, anything's new here. And, and this, the 71% uh, percent is, like, it's triggering me, man. I need to finish that. Every time I look over there, it's, like, 71%. And I know there's reapers here. But that is something that the Reapers will have to deal with. Okay, why does it take all my fuel to get to Asgard? Oh, and we can actually see it right here. <laughs> Low key. Alright, what is this one? Alright, worth. Alliance, Spec Ops, and Delta. Delta, guys. Yeah, Reapers hate me. Fuck. No, no, no. No! No Reapers, please. No. Even Not that hole. Fuck. No, I can't get that one now. I went all the way over here. Okay, let's see. Can we bait them? And then, like, get it? On the way out? No, because they go faster. Alright, we fucking lost. Because we always enter from that side of the galaxy, so... Guess what? It's gonna remain low. I just gotta do a mission and then come back there. Alright. I, I I don't even want to play this game anymore. Just fucking end it. Alright, a sorry colony or... Alright, sure. Why not a sorry colony? Let's do that. Alright. We may need fuel. But for some reason, uh... I found something. Oh, cool. This is the easiest way of getting fuel, obviously. 650 units of fuel. There you go, easy fuel. Alright, we may have to leave this place before we continue doing stuff. Someone warned me that the Reaper alertness might be a bit annoying. Intact Reaper weapon. Alright, let's go. Uh, we'll go this one, to this one first, because I assume they all have things. I mean, it says 33% though. I found like, I don't know, one or two things. Signal confirmed. Oh, nice. The Reapers are mad at me. Here it is. I was like, this one's actually not terrible. Because at least they're not like, Library of uh, Asha. There you go, 50%. Investigate a sorry colony. And apparently Reapers don't like this place. This place just smells. So is there any indication like there there would be nothing here? Because I feel like an idiot just going around systems that, you know, probably don't have anything. Whatever. Just go down here. Alright. It's an ugly planet. A bug planet. And take uh, Javik, because he's been hilarious so far. He works well with Garrus. Guys, I paid fifteen dollars for that guy. I didn't pay anything actually. Jokes on you. All right, every round has a twenty-five percent chance of not using the thermal clip. Well, that's worthless. What are we up to now? It doesn't tell me what version of the concentration mod it is, but I assume it's a very high level one. Whatever. I'm still content with 200% below uh, speed for this ship. Alright, I guess we could upgrade this, the grenades. Should I do one for, for flanking or should I do one for damage? Uh, yeah, the damage isn't that much, but the giving it the ability to, even if I miss, to basically allow it to 
still kind of do something is actually kind of nice. Alright. Dig up any information on the mission, Lear? A sorry high command hid a lot from us. You're headed to an Ardat Yakshi monastery. Ardat Yakshi? Like Morinth? No. These Ardat Yakshi lived in the monastery so they wouldn't or couldn't harm anyone. However, they're still powerful biotics and potentially very dangerous. That's why High Command sent commandos to investigate the monastery's distress signal. So what does the Sorry High Command want us to do? If there was a chance the Ardat Yakshi could break loose, the commandos were to purge the monastery. Purge? You mean destroy? They would have brought heavy explosives with them, yes. Morinth was dangerous, but are the Ardat Yakshi this big of a threat? Morinth was just hitting her stride. Ardat Yakshi who kill leave behind astronomical body counts. That's why High Command won't rest until this place is destroyed. They'd never risk a single Ardat Yakshi getting loose. They chose a bad time for a prison break. I want this done fast as possible. We locate the commandos, then finish the job. Good. The sooner you finish, the sooner Asari High Command stops wasting lives here. Alright, that is a really awkward animation that that ship took to get over there. Alright, and also I'm clipping into myself. Oh no, wrong one. Uh... Did not go to the proper one. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now it's on the right one. Alright. Let's go. Whoa. No elevator or power. Well, I'm definitely flying on the ground, over the ground. Hey, Garrus, I can fly. Oh, yeah, there's something over here. Assault rifle stability something is something other. Uh, I can't start running backwards. I can only I can only do backflips. All right, team. Oh shit! They they teleported. I was just complimenting the game that I didn't have to do that that often, but uh, apparently it does. Sounds close. And it has friends. Oh good, it went dark too. Hello? Alright, students are not allowed to visit each other's quarters or remain in rooms unsupervised by staff. Wow, last year is our shelter. I hear something. Stay sharp. The thing is, in games like this, I absolutely positively know that nothing's gonna spawn until I get into a room or some trigger point. I heard something. That was me. Sorry. It's <laughs> fucking great. I'm just saying. I could probably pass that door because nothing ever spawns until you get to a trigger point. That's how these games work. Reapers, looks like we know why the commando teams went silent. This monastery is out of the way. What do the Reapers want with Ardat Yakshi? Anything useful? A map with a nav point location for a bomb. It's in the Great Hall. At least it's no surprise Nuke gone to Chanka, but the commandos want this place gone pretty badly. This place is a lost cause if it's already crawling with Reapers. Let's get to the Great Hall and set off that bomb. Oh, wants me to go that way. But I want to go this way. See, if I was a developer, this is what I'd do. I'd be a total asshole. I'm going to be like, when you go into this room, you know, 25% chance something spawns and it doesn't make any noise. It just kind of, you know, eventually follows you, you know, while you're just roaming the room. So you don't know when shit happens in the game. That's what, that's what I'd do. Surprised no, no developers do that kind of, do that kind of shit. 
But I'm just an asshole. And my games would reflect that. Fortunately for you guys, I don't make games, so... Yet. No, I, I don't make games. I explored that a little bit. Too much math. And graphics. I'm not a very good artist. That's the thing. And you, you, you had developers with not a lot of good art skills do, they make fucking pixel games. That's what they do. I understand them. I can relate. Very good. I almost didn't hear you. Samara. It has been some time, Shepard. You are a most welcome sight. The corruption here runs deep. What brings the Justicar out here? My daughters have lived here for centuries, Garrus. I've come for them. Unfortunately, the Reapers had already infested this place by the time I arrived. You met me hunting down your other Ardat Yakshi daughter. Are these ones just as dangerous? Valer and Rila have followed the monastery's rules ever since they arrived. They've shown no inclination toward violence. And you're here to save them? They are my responsibility. And it's one that cannot be abandoned, even as our galaxy crumbles. Find your daughters fast. I'm setting off a bomb the commandos brought here. The Justicar Code demands I discover what happened to my children in this monastery. I cannot ignore it. We're out of time. We'll meet again. I will draw these creatures off. Wait! Let's go. Ah. that Yakshi must have believed they were safe from the war. If they knew about it at all. They learned. Well, this seems like a giant courtyard for fighting. So I'm gonna go this way. Oh, shit. Thermal clips. Why the fuck is it jiggling around? Get the fuck out of here. Jairus, take care of that. Why is it alive? I blame you. And I get all the glory. <laughs> Alright, is there another one? I guess go over here. I don't know where these guys keep spawning. And powerful. The Reapers are converting Asari slaves to their side. I guess we know what happened to the uh, Arctic, uh, Arctic Yoshis, of course. As soon as I was able. Shepard, 
This is Faler, my youngest. She and her sister Rila are Ardat Yakshi. They have Mother, been... they have Rila. What? I saw some of those creatures take her into the Great Hall. I've been trying to get there. What are the Reapers doing here? Harvesting us. They're turning us into... Into those... Monsters. Please. You can't let that happen to Rila. The Asari thought the Ardat Yachi were to blame for the attack. This is our home. Most of us are grateful to be here. The monastery is a place Ardat Yakshi can achieve peace. Valer speaks truthfully, Shepard. I vouch for her words with pride. There's a bomb in the Great Hall. We're setting it off, so find your sister quickly. A bomb? But I thought you came to rescue us. I'm here because this place is a liability. A liability? My friends have been killed, turned into... Falaire, we did not come to argue. No, you came to destroy us. Got that right. Valer! The Great Hall. She's looking for Rila. Look for that bomb. I doubt we'll miss it. Shit, I want to try a floating technique. Let me go. Ah, uh, didn't work. Maybe next time. Uh, so once we go there, but seriously, all right. I think we should go over here first. Look at these computers. Actually, what the fuck? We're not gonna have much luck with those doors. You figure? Between the Reapers and Commandos, I'm amazed this building's still standing. Oh, oh, he's just have Garrus's commentary. A disciple? <clears throat> I don't know what that is. Probably should do a round at the uh, council or something, try out some new guns. Fuck. A oh, cool free experience. Actually, I haven't needed, uh, well, I, I've never needed uh, health packs technically, but uh, I was gonna say more or less that, like, uh, haven't needed to actually, you know. Uh, I haven't, I haven't damaged myself at all, actually, so far. Uh, new girl in the holding chamber, just a carp for, uh... Matrix Galley. Uh... Okay. Some story there, I just kind of skimmed through it. It was kind of whatever. My clock does not care about the story. Oh. Help Garrus out. Fuck. Is that Javik? 
giving me a... Sorry, blowjob. Told he was. Can't blame him, though. Wait, can I jump over this thing? No, it's not possible. So, question is, can I tell teammates to... No, they won't res each other. Which I find to be kind of a flaw. I guess Garrus Jr. got them all. What's this one? Precision scope. Definitely Garrus needs that. Actually, I don't think he's affected by accuracy at all. I think someone was yelling at me when I put that on one time. But don't worry, I've taken that off now. Uh, probably. I actually don't know what they have. I don't think it really matters what they have. Oh, doors open. A bomb? There's our bomb. And Falaire. <laughs> Examine the bomb. <laughs> Fuck the family moment. The bombs, dude. Rila? Uh, Rila, can you hear me? they've begun to turn her into one of the Reaper's creatures. I'm sorry. Can we set off that bomb? Not without a detonator. Commandos would have had one. We've got to find it. Kind of awkward in a sniping position. <laughs> okay, what the dude? What's the one behind it doing? Oh wait, that's an actual normal animation. I was just glitching the fuck out. Garrus. Oh shit! Fuck! Fuck! What? How the? Fuck do they know? I was invisible, guys. I couldn't possibly have been in the same exact same position. It's just impossible. Fuck! They're hard to snipe. I tickled. It's actually a pretty good weapon for dealing with these. Quick clear. The fuck? For now. Let's get back to that bomb. Move! No! Rila! 
I love you. Rila! even time to say goodbye few can break the reaper's hold Rila's will was extraordinary as was her love for you we left her to die Rila made her choice and it has reminded me of what is truly important why I swore I'd lay down my life what is that Valer, the code demands an Ardat Yakshi cannot live outside a monastery that no longer exists. What are you doing? I'm sorry, Shepard. By the Justicar's code, there is only one way to save Valer. Mother, no! My daughters, you were all so. Let. Go. What are you doing? Fulfilling the code. By throwing your life away? I won't kill my last daughter. You won't have to. Valer? I'll stay here. Home. No matter what's become of it. Without a proper monastery, I could have left any time. I don't need a building to honor my own code. And if the Reapers return, they won't take me alive. I promise. Then, the code permits you to stay, as you are. Once this war is over, and if I am able, I will visit, as a Justicar should. I meant it when I said the galaxy needs you against the Reapers. You were right. It's past time I joined your battle. I'll fight in your armies, Shepard, once I speak with Valer. I'll be waiting. Not for long. Thank you, my friend. Everything's taken care of down here. Bring in the shuttle. Right, Commander. I'll just follow the smoke. It did not sound like it was coming from a radio. I read your report, Commander. We had no idea the situation had deteriorated so quickly. That's why I set off the bomb. There were no Ardat Yakshi left. May the Ardat Yakshi find rest. What the Reapers did to them was monstrous. I had another team of commandos headed to the monastery who I can now formally transfer to Admiral Hackett's command. They'll serve you loyally, Commander. Farewell. All right. Let's see. Uh, uh, we got Spec Ops Team Delta and uh, the Commandos and Samara herself. How is uh, how's Samara more powerful than than Commandos? Just saying. 
Alright, uh, I don't think they will have dialogue after this, but we'll see, I guess. Maybe they will. I see some new tech from the Sorry government. Okay. I'm glad they've decided to help the war effort. Everybody has to fight now, no matter how pretty you are. <laughs> I learned that the hard way. Hey, you're ugly. Commander. Fucker. All right. Holy shit. My sister got everything set up in the Citadel. Memorial. Discovered a few things about my sister, but there's something else going on. I'm, I'm on this at all. Find a place to meet, send you an point. Alright, we gotta talk to her. Uh, Garrus. r, &R near the shuttles. Samara. Samara's just chilling. Sorry, squad. Yeah. Getting away from work. Come see me next time we dock on the Citadel. Javik wants to also see things on the Citadel. I believe this concept of galactic control shared among races is a lie. Damn. You'd make a good slav. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, it's, it's, it's one of my fucking Discord jokes, sorry. This gonna have a hard time recruiting now. What? Why? Glad you talked Samara down. I never thought I'd see her flinch from her duty. I don't know. On one hand, that code's all she's had to live by for, God, centuries. And the galaxy goes to hell. The old rules don't cut it anymore. I mean, we're cutting some corners, right? A few. Well, the Alliance can always court-martial us after we save the galaxy. Commander? What are you doing, Edie? Monitoring reports of proton storms and other space weather. With the Reapers attacking the Combuy systems, critical warnings may be lost. How bad are these storms? If we are warned, not bad. If we are not warned, very bad. Thanks for the info, Edie. Hello, Shepard. I guess you do have to talk to everyone. It's too bad, guys. It looks like, yeah, we have a shit ton of things to do on the Citadel when we get, when we get back there. Garrus mentioned something about you two having some fun next time you're on the Citadel. Don't get into trouble. What? Why does she tell you? This is between me and Garrus, you fucking nosy piece of shit. Garrus is my friend. You are not my friend. You can go fuck off and die in some fucking I don't know. That that cave that we were in with, with a bunch of flamethrowers. I, I can I cannot imagine a fate worse than that. Fuck! It makes me so mad. Is there any point in this door being open? Why is it open? Everybody was fighting the Ragnar trying to push them back through the relay. Finally, the Krogan were turned loose and stopped them. I see. But when the Krogan rebelled, we had to deploy the Genophage to stop them. Wasn't the only rebellion. A thousand years later, the Geth revolted against the Quarians. That was a whole other war. Then along came the humans. My own people tangled with them for a while, and now, to top it all off, We've got the Reapers. What about you? The Ouroboros fought the Densorin. The Andoromai conquered the Vanduma. And the Jatil turned against the Jar. So, I guess nobody really ever gets their act together. The Sinril claimed to have found the path to eternal peace. What happened? The Ditika preferred war and wiped them out. I hope you guys had alcohol. Samara's the kind of soldier we need in this war. Nothing gets in her way. I just hope I... Fuck. I did it again, my bad. Now it's a mutated Asari. The Reapers are just a giant nightmare factory that never ends. I constantly think they're done, and then they don't. Finish. I can only imagine what the Reapers are doing to the Drell. Or the Hanar. Or the Vorcha. This could get a lot worse before it gets better. Maybe later. Some of the crew seem shocked by the monstrosities we have encountered. They haven't seen what the Reapers could corrupt after a hundred years. That was our war. Every battle conjured a new nightmare. 
This human holds such childish views of war. Your species has much to learn. Commander. Commander. It's a brilliant tactic, when you think about it. But it's evil. When has that ever mattered in war? Yeah, but converting other life forms into reapers? I, I can't wrap my head around that. Makes sense to me. It ensures you never run out of cannon fodder. Eliminates any local resistance. And for every soldier you add, your enemy loses two. The one you converted, and his buddy on the other side who can't pull the trigger on a friend. You sound like you admire them. Same way I admire a virus or a thresher mob. They've adapted perfectly to their situation. But the Reapers want to destroy us. And I have no intention of letting them. But if you don't respect your enemy's capabilities, you're in for one nasty surprise after another. Okay. I guess it was triggered by me leaving or something. Because I talked to them and then they started attacking and then like, eh. Have we heard from Agent Detrace yet? She has not reported in for over eight hours, Doctor. She was stationed on Valchir when the Reapers invaded. I think we can assume what happened. Inform Agent Calamus he's now in charge of reporting Reaper activity past the lowest relay. Oh, there we go. Intact Reaper weapon. So we can either do ammo or weapon damage. I am going to do weapon damage. Because we don't have a problem with that. Alright, and then Elk Shark Signature, Store Discount, or Power Damage Bonus. I mean, I guess I'll do the power damage bonus. I'll eventually get all the store upgrades, so... Poor Rila. But I'm glad she set off that bomb, Shepard. You're not upset the monastery was destroyed? No. Not after what I saw. I don't care that they were Ardat Yakshi. To be turned into such creatures, nobody deserves that. Hello again. The private messages terminal has new correspondence... Oh, the Caden terminal wants to talk. Oh, okay. Hey, Chuck Wells. It would help all involved if you could bash a trade of Bye, Chuck Wells. No, definitely not going there anymore. Well, we don't have to go to the fourth deck now, because, uh. reasons. Hey, Commander. I dug out the oh. to make some unusual friends, Shepard. I thought she was done. That is not a side of these sorry I ever want to see. I gotta stop being so, like. Happy to press space bar, I'm sorry. Shepard. 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 <laughs> Ashley. Oh my god. I just want to fucking go somewhere. Alright. Aren't we already on the crew deck? Yeah, that's what I thought. And engineering won't have anything. Yeah, it's done. Alright. Uh, I mean, the only other thing I can think of is, uh, I think I got some new shit, but I, unfortunately I can't really tell. Yeah, I really can't, though. I think there's, like, new gauntlets or something. Honestly, I don't think any of this is really, like, gonna change anything, because I, I, I like what I have. Alright, well, let's end the episode then, so, uh, fucking, it's almost 40 minutes, fucking hell. Yeah, whatever, Lyra talks to me all the time. Alright, bye guys.